Recently, Lisa Murphy has been named the winner of the Trades House of Glasgow Modern Apprentice Award. So I came along to the Lighthouse to meet her. Lisa has worked here in the Lighthouse in Glasgow a couple of times, but in particular, she's worked on an exhibition called Hello, Paul Smith. And today, we're going to check her out in action. Lisa had a great application. She met all the criteria. It was clear that she performed well technically. She reaches out to help her, her team members and she clearly has shown leadership ability throughout the, the apprenticeship so far. She has a very mature approach to her apprenticeship. She is very skilled at a very early stage and very competent at a very early stage. And that's because of her uh, enthusiasm and also her determination. So Lisa, this is some of the work that you were actually involved in here in this exhibition. There's a lot of stripes there and they are absolutely perfect. How much work went into this? Hard work. What a measure this. <laughs> really? Yeah. Very time consuming. Very steady hand. I would be horrible, horrible at that. But is it something that you enjoy? Was it a good project to work on? Yeah. One of the best projects I've worked on. Really? Yeah. And is it, did you think that you put a lot into practice of what you'd learn in the like in the classroom sort of more scenarios like that? Mm -hmm. More from your college stuff because they're really precise so this job had to be precise. And was this work part of your application for the, the award at the, the Trades House? Did you put in what you've worked on here or is it just about you as an apprentice? It's just a collection of all the projects that I have been on and they've just kind of seen how well I've proved myself. What does the award actually mean to you then? Is it, it's a big thing to get that, that wee bit of prize money in there as well and to get an award, a title that says you're probably the best apprentice in Scotland at the moment. That must be very cool. That is cool. I was surprised. I never expected that at all. I was up against, I think it was five other apprentices, which was quite tough with the companies they worked with. Brilliant. And do you think you learn a lot from some of the other apprentices on the job? Have you got a good team to, to show you what to do, your manager, things like that? Do you, yeah, do you learn but, a lot? Well, I've got good experience because it's not just managers that I'm learning off of, it's like fourth year apprentices and third year apprentices who've right. been in my situation who's still carrying me, basically. <laughs> celebrates the success, not just for them, but of the whole Apprentice programme. I think they're really important. When a young person starts, they are, they are formally trained, but they also pick up the experience in the workplace at the same time. But not only that, importantly, they're paid whilst they do that. Uh, and I think that's key. I really enjoy my job. It's the best way to learn, I'd say, instead of being stuck in the one place, like college, every single day. I like your overall as well here. Uh, is this designed by yourself? Yeah. <laughs> Well, I had to make up the colours and instead of washing out a brush every time, I just want to test it out in the overalls. <laughs> test it on the overall. Well, I think it looks brilliant and I'm very, very impressed with your work. And congratulations on the award. What an achievement. Very good.